Good morning, folks. A couple shots here. The skies rolling over the western Albuquerque Mesa around sunset. The storms were harsh when overhead, but incredible to watch dance around the valley like tall, isolated streams. The wind was strong enough to take down a few trees down the road. In the aftermath, the beauty really set in. The sun was painting his little heart out in the skies. Jumping to the sun in 131 angstroms, and we're watching small C-class solar flares erupting from a newly entered sunspot group. Let's go to spaceweathernews.com and find the last day on our star in 193 angstroms. Apart from the dark coronal hole in the north, the activity at that bright active region to the left is what steals one's attention. We have watched solar flaring uptick the last few days, but there may already be evidence of it slowing back down under the earth-facing quiet. There actually appeared to be more significant CME potential as it turned over the limb. It was doing a relatively proficient job at putting plasma visibly out into the corona at least, but that has somewhat ceased as it turns in and we get a better look. The ejections have made way for mere x-ray emission spikes during the flares, but we will have our eyes on it, along with the plasma filaments dancing to the north of it. The sunspot appears complex right off the bat, and also seems to be in sets of couples, two, 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 two. And when we come to the magnetogram, we see that there is interactive potential. This one will be monitored closely over the coming days. Quick look at the solar wind shows calming telemetry. Remember, we are awaiting the impact of the coronal hole stream. Northern Reach faced Earth starting a bit more than a day ago, so we've likely got to wait until late tonight or tomorrow for that one to arrive. We've got an article linked below telling how long you would expect a drought to last in your area once it begins. Pink and blue areas recover the slowest. Sadly, barren land recovery time is not given. We also have an interesting link to a 3D simulation of cosmic jets from galactic centers, including how energy stored in the magnetic fields is released upon interacting with the ambient medium. Sometimes the releases can be sudden and powerful. Have to mention some top weather watches as a tropical system dances off the east coast. The tornado, hail, and storm alerts will come to the northern central states tonight. That system that crossed the UK over the last 24 hours is now headed northeast at Norway and Sweden. After that, we are moving down to the South Island of New Zealand, readying to take another southern low. That'll be towards the end of this sequence here. We will have the rest of the world's weather current conditions and shots of our star to close. We greatly appreciate your support and we'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now. It's 4.20 a.m. in the new valley of the sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.